Hey there everybody, it's me, Jimmy Hoppa from Import Gaming for the Win, and I'm back with yet another pickups video, very shortly after the last one, and uh, well if you clicked on this video you probably know what it's about, uh, if you saw the title or the thumbnail. Uh, well I got this package today in the mail uh, from Amazon, it's uh, something that I've, I pre-ordered quite a while ago, and I just wanted to share this real quick with everybody. thought about doing a... Uh, it's kind of special new video series, Import Gaming LTD or something like that, where I talk about limited editions that only came out in Japan, but since I'm working on two videos and I want to get those out as soon as possible, I figure a quick little pickups video would be neat. Uh, and this is something, uh, well, as you know from the checking out the video, it's Dragon's Crown Pro, uh, which just got released yesterday here in Japan. Um, this is the day after I ordered this from Amazon, so unfortunately I couldn't get it day one. But uh, I, uh, I love the Dragon's Crown game. I love uh, Vanillaware. I love George Kamitani's work. Pretty much uh, everything they've done. And uh, you know, I've probably shown things here and there, but I collect a lot of things from uh, George Kamitani's games. Uh, figures and all that stuff. I even, uh, right over here, I'll probably show a picture. I've got a little signed uh, picture of Dragon's Crown. And actually, one of the very first videos I ever put out on this channel was a Dragon's Crown video guide for all the quests in the game and uh oh my god i don't know how to cut and uh yeah unfortunately that's the the most uh, viewed video on this channel uh something that i didn't really put that much effort into and it's got, got quite a pretty good amount of views back then i was excited because i thought it was, my channel was going to blow up because of it but you know <laughs> it never happened but yeah uh this is before i open this up this is uh, not just any, any edition of Dragon's Crown, it's not the standard edition, it's a limited edition, obviously. Um, and a lot of shops in Japan will have different kind of like bonus uh, incentives. It's not just like one store like in the States, GameStop, you get crappy DLC costumes that are already on the disc. Um, but they'll like, you know, they'll offer like something that's sort of like a tapestry, which uh, is something that Softmap tends to do a lot, or like a phone card option. Uh, stuff like that, and uh, well this one, I, I was looking around for this because I knew I wanted it. Um, and there were some stores that had kind of cool bonuses, and uh, well I looked on Amazon and they had an exclusive uh, set, and it's called uh, the, uh, I guess an EB10 exclusive, but it's the Amazon, uh, what is it, uh, Dragon's Crown Pro Royal Package uh, Famitsu Deluxe Pack 3D Crystal Set, which is the, I guess basically the most elite or whatever <laughs> the, the most elite edition of the game um, and so I'm just gonna open it up and we'll take a look at it together and uh, see what it's like it's a pretty heavy box but uh, yeah hopefully there's no personal information here nothing uh, risque in this uh, package this time thankfully oh wow look at that okay so uh, you know what I'll, I'll look at the other extra stuff first but this looks like this is the game uh, I got the PlayStation 4 version and uh, Kind of want. I think it, it only come out for PS4. I think there. Yeah, it was only a PS4 thing, but you can still play with the Vita and PS3 uh, editions. But well, here is the game. I can get it out of this damn bubble wrap. Oh man, look at that! So it comes with this really nice package. Let's see if I can zoom it out a little bit. So got all the characters there. Man, look at that! Some really great artwork. Um, let's uh, let's open it up. Well, here's what's in it. A little bit of D DLC stuff. I don't want to show you my code. Let me go ahead and uh, probably just rip this right off. There you go. I don't have to use that uh, 100 yen store cutter I bought. So here's the package. Oh, I don't know if you can pick that up, but really nice kind of material there. Nice to the touch. Kind of a half gloss, half matte kind of thing. You gotta have your, your OB, your spying card. You can never throw those away. Increase the value of this game one day by thirty dollars. Uh, let's open it up. So the royal package. This is the standard limited edition that you could get at any old store, um, and it, I think it was like hundred something dollars just for it. Standard. Wow, look at that. Well, I thought there was gonna be nothing risque, but there you go. Dragon's Crown Pro Orchestra Album Special Booklet. Let's take a look at that first. So. Oh wow, look at that. It's just a little bit of a uh, Toshisaki Moto. Oh, I didn't even know he did the CD for this, or that the music for this game. It's like my favorite video game composer. I wonder I like the music from this game so much. Some great artwork, some 
track. So I'm assuming there's three discs in here. And uh, yeah, some really great artwork. So I'm, I'm just kind of getting absorbed in the art myself. When I was playing this game, I always played as the uh, Archer character, which uh, I got really used to. And had a lot of fun playing that game online with, with randos and friends. Okay, then here's a little bit of the orchestra sessions in Sydney. Oh, look at that. Alright, that's pretty cool. And look at that artwork over there. Pretty glossy too. Alright, that's pretty neat. So, you can get a little set of, set of liner notes. Digital art collection. So I'm assuming on the back there's a little code. Um, I think it's like a little digital art book. Take a look in the back. Well, flashed a little code there. But yeah, there is definitely a code. Look at that Vanillaware logo. Very fancy. And there you go. Music composed by Hitoshi Sakimoto. Wow. Uh, he's responsible for some of my favorite favorite soundtracks. Probably my favorite soundtrack of all time. Tactics Ogre as well. Uh, him and like, was it Masaharu Iwata? But uh, Vagrant Story and uh, just just part of Final Fantasy Tactics, among other things. But yeah, great, great composer. And I always wondered why. Well, I didn't wonder why I like the the soundtrack for this game because it's great. But well, it makes sense why it really stuck. So I'm gonna be careful and cut this open. Hopefully, I didn't cut the plastic. Let's we'll take a look at the CDs. Dragon's Crown Pro Orchestra Album. Okay. So, now I have the soundtrack. And I'm assuming this is the complete soundtrack because it's three CDs and not just one the rain stuff. Alright. Three goddesses. Okay. Pretty cool. I'll take a listen to that later. Put it in my uh, phone for listening later. And, uh, well, here's the game. Uh, I guess it, it comes with some sort of uh, digital, digital game book, so that's kind of cool. And uh, yeah, Dragon's Pro Crown Pro is just the game, nothing really special about it, I'm sure. Actually, has the barcode, unlike some other limited editions. All right, I hate to uh, come over here and interrupt my video like this, but uh, I downloaded all this uh, stuff and popped the game in, and there's a few things that I thought I probably should talk about uh, regarding the downloadable content. Uh, first, of course, was this uh, digital art collection. And uh, yeah, you just download it from the PS4 store, and it's uh, it's an art collection, just as you'd expect. Really, really beautiful stuff, really a great presentation, as you'd expect from a Vanillaware uh, project. Um, yeah, you got a lot of the artwork, uh, promotional artwork that you'd see. Uh, like if you got the uh, Dragon's Crown pre-order art book from way back when it was uh, released, uh, a lot of that stuff's in there too. But there's also some pretty cool, uh, there's a bestiary, like Beasts of Highlander, I think it's, they call it. Uh, where you can take a look at all the models of the uh, the enemy characters, including the bosses, and kind of go through all their different animations. And uh, yeah, really cool and uh, beautiful bonus. Uh, this also came with a, a, a PS4 theme. Uh, so there's a Dragon's Crown Pro digital uh, theme in there. It's kind of standard. Um, got some nice music, some nice pictures, some of the icons are changed, but not all that special. Uh, as far as the game itself, popped it in, played it. It's good old Dragon's Crown with, uh, I guess, nicer graphics and an orchestrated soundtrack. Uh, but what it also came with, and it was advertised on the front, was a digital game book. And what it is, I thought it might have been a guide, so I didn't think it was that important. But it's this. Let me pop it out over here. The uh, Dragon's Crown game book, uh, Dragon's Crown Adventure, uh, Akuryojima no Hiho, or uh, the uh, Treasure of Demon Island. And what this is, is an old school kind of choose your own adventure uh, RPG book type of thing. Uh, but in digital form. Really cool presentation. You go on a, choose a character, go on an adventure, level up, fight things. Uh, pretty cool. And, you know, I didn't play it too much because I wanted to get this video done. But who knows, maybe I'll stream it sometime if anyone's interested. But yeah, that's uh, back to the regular video. Alright, well, that's all the stuff that came with the uh, Royal Package. Um, what came with the. The <laughs> Famitsu Deluxe Pack 3D Crystal Set was. Take a look at this first. This little thing here. This is actually, I believe, a smartphone case. Yep, there you go. A multi size. This is for large smartphones. And I wonder if. Uh, yeah, I'll try to see if my phone fits in it later. I don't really have that big of a phone. But eh, we'll just open this up. Why not? It's pretty fancy. Made. Oh, look at that. I was going to say made in China, I'm sure, but made in Japan. That's very nice. Uh, 
Let's take a look. I know it's blasphemy. You get these limited editions, you're not supposed to open them up, but... I don't care, I'm not going to be selling this, hopefully. Unless I'm dying. Maybe I'm speaking too soon. It's a little, got a little bit of magnet here. And, uh, yeah, there you go. Got a little place for you to put some cards. Maybe put some cash. Oh, that's this over here. Okay, just a little bit of instructions. Cool. It's magnetized over here, too. Got some runes. That's pretty cool. like that. Okay. And right over here is a Dragon's Crown Pro Puzzle. And, uh, yeah, I'll take a look at this. Well, nothing here. 300 pieces. Maybe I'll, uh, I'll put this together up, uh, put this together later and uh, we'll take a look at it but yeah dragon's crown crown pro puzzle I just got that Tifa puzzle the other day and put that together so my puzzle time puzzle making times increased by quite a bit these days okay and the last thing here in this box is well, this is the heavy thing over here let me move this box out of the way give me a little bit more space to work with um, and inside of this is something that uh, it's the last part of the, the name for this uh, special edition set. And uh, I think it's Pamitsu, whoever puts these out. They tend to do this with a lot of other game series. But, okay, I believe this is, uh, is going to be a base, and this is going to be the thing. Uh, I'll open up some in a fancy little box. It's upside down, too. So, in here is. It's like giving, uh, giving your lady friend something special on Valentine's. It's, like a, it's actually a treasure. Look at that fancy box. <laughs> it's an engagement ring in there. But I don't think anybody would want to engage, get engaged to me with this present. That's fine. I don't know if you can see it, but... Oh, wow. Look at that. Okay, that's the opposite way. Here you go. I don't know how well that shows up. But it is a laser sketched um, 3d crystal kind of thing it's kind of thing that you'd go on a vacation and buy like a if you're on like a boat tour you go to the bahamas you get a little crystal 3d crystal uh, laser etched souvenir to give to your i don't know your dad that he's going to put on his computer desk but this one's dragon's crown and it's the sorcerer and uh, i really like this artwork of the sorceress too or a sorceress or a sorcerer whatever we don't judge here um, and I believe this is a little stand, LED stand to light it up with. I'm not sure if the batteries are included, but uh, or if it's solar or something. But if not, I will take a look at it later, and I'll light it up. So looks like there's no batteries in it. So three triple A's, or yeah, double A's. Sorry about that. But uh, yeah, you just place it on here, and it lights up. And uh, I'll do that later. I'll do that. I guess I'll put a video of it right here so you can take a look and it should be pretty cool and uh, I have some uh, sorceress figurines right over there in my glass display case because <laughs> I have a glass display case with Dragon's Crown sorceress figurines and I think it'll look pretty cool right next to them and uh, stupid me I was uh, cleaning up right now and I checked the box and I didn't even notice that there's a little tapestry a wall scroll poster in there as well so add that to the list of things that come with the uh, with this uh, package. So let's just open it up and take a look. And I have really nowhere to hang this, to be honest, but it's kind of cool to have. And I'm guessing it's probably kind of long. So I'll probably just have to take a picture of it and insert it here. But oh, look at that. It's the, uh, the warrior, the two warriors, Amazon is in, I guess, is it the knight? So. Cool. I'll just uh, take a picture here, and uh, yeah, I don't know why the uh... okay, it's double-sided. You got a, a bottom and a top string. I was gonna say, did they put the string on the bottom? That would have been pretty dumb. But I'm the dumb one. Uh, but yeah, maybe uh, back to the video or ending it now. Bye. But uh, yeah, I guess uh, I'll clean this up later, and I'll get a nice shot of everything together. Well, that is the Dragon's Crown Pro, the PlayStation 4 Dragon's Crown Pro Royal Package Famitsu Deluxe Pack 3D Crystal Set that I got on Amazon.com. And uh, I think, uh, yeah, it was just like maybe like 70 bucks more than the regular limited edition. So I figured why not go for it because I love this game and I love uh, this company that makes these games. Uh, but yeah, that's about it. Very short video. Hope you enjoyed it. And uh, 
Fortunately, you can't buy these now because I think they were pre-order only. But um, hey, if you got Dragon's Crown on the PlayStation 4, 3, or Vita, hit me up and maybe we can play sometime. Uh, that's it for my video, Jimmy Hoffa. I'm going to be working on some real content pretty soon. Uh, you guys take it easy. Take care.